Welcome back to Kentucky Mountain Vlogs. Today, well, there was a snake in the pigeons. I don't know why my lens is fogging up right now. Oh, I do know why. Today, there was a snake in the pigeons. And I don't really like snakes being in the pigeon coop. Mostly because they just killed two of the babies. Thursday? No, Friday, I think. Yeah, Friday. Just killed two of the babies. Plus, there was one in there earlier. So, I'm trying to catch the mice to catch the snakes. And I'm using these straps. So I'm gonna bait him up and then fry it. Okay, I got it baited up now. And also I got this homemade one with some peanut butter in it. And this one's just got some nails in it like a mirror trap. See? Like a mirror trap. So I'm gonna try to do that. So I'm gonna go set these up. Bugs are terrible. Okay. We're good. I'm going to put this one in the greenhouse because they're eating all our lettuce. They're eating all our lettuce, so bad mice. Bad. That's what they get for eating our lettuce. Be caught in a trap and being used as snake bait. If we catch a snake, it's not going to be no more alive. There's Maria, but there's the trap. I'm just going to set it like that. It's just a regular old cage trap, but miniature. I'll set that under there. See? Walks in. Touch that little flat thing in the center with the paint butter on it. That door's closed. And these snakes are trying to eat the pigeons this morning. Well, actually, what happened was Friday. It was night. Went down there to check them to eat the pigeons. We had two babies. And that just hatched out like they were getting ready to fly. Like probably they've been flying that Saturday. Which was this Saturday. So, went down there and checked it. And I noticed the one was dead. And then... I forgot the keys. No, this one was dead, and then we didn't see the other one. Shine the light down at the ground. The light died right when I did that. So I ran up, got the light, shine at the ground. There was a giant snake, maybe four, four and a half foot snake, right next to me with a baby pigeon in its mouth. And I was sure not happy about that. So I shot that snake up with a BB gun. Cause that was the quickest thing I could grab. So, after that, I thought, oh, there's not gonna be another one. Next day, staying next to it. Oh, oh, staying next to the pigeon coop again. Oh, staying and looking at it, make sure there wasn't any in there. Looked again, seen there was uh, another four and a half foot one. Climbed up the side, four and a half foot black snake. I didn't get a picture of any of them, but I do know they're there. They're in the creek, but it just flooded, so. They're not in the creek no more. I hate these snakes. And if you're wondering, if you're going to say, oh, they're good for your mice population or something like that. I make my own traps. We got mice problem. I make a trap, put it in it, and then we'll make a trap, set it. If they don't catch nothing, then we don't have mice. But I was trying to catch a bunny rabbit in there. I was trying. I was using live cages to try to catch it. See, maybe I could build some traps, um, live catch traps, and try to you know, experiment on it. Try to make some homemade traps. Invent a new type of trap, live catch trap. I don't know why the screen is so dark. Okay. Okay, it just lightened up. And then today, let's walk next to the pigeon coop. Later, if I remember, I'll just like show you like where they were or what was going on. And today, no, it didn't get any more pigeons. It only got the first two that first night. Then, I was walking down there today. So, if I find the right key. If I can hold on to the keys. I don't know how I can do this one-handed, but... Yep, that's right. Ah, I got it. 
uh, got rid of the bolt. Let's just say them snakes will no longer be eating anything, any pigeons, or anything else that tries to get that they want to eat. Let's see. Did that do great. Hold on. Fix this. Now I'm gonna try to catch some bait. So I'm technically killing two things at one time. So I'm gonna bait these up, put them in here. Okay, I got them set up. And also, I fixed one I've been trying. That's broke, kinda. I don't know, it had a coat hanger holding it together, so. Yeah, I'm gonna show that. And the ones I'm gonna be using. That one I set up the garden, exact same trap. See, so look. Exact same trap. This one was the one I fixed. If you can tell, this is what it's supposed to look like. These fancy little metal things. This one. has a coat hanger bent. This coat hanger would not latch. This one would. Barely. But this one was just stuck down. So what I did is I bent it and it worked. So I'm not complaining. I'm super happy. I still got that one with the nails in it. And a bunch of peanut butter somehow. I probably should not grab such a big container of peanut butter. I smell my... Okay, that's where I'm sitting. I'm sitting right in this area right here next to the four wheelers where there's a pile of food Except <sighs> so the other one probably in this truck down here over here because There's mice in it too. Exactly. There's mice in it Purple out in a truck. There's mice in a truck Okay, big straight right now. There's mice in the truck. I'm setting this little fish Fish, fish trap jar trap in here. Hopefully I catch up. I've never caught nothing in it except for uh, can't remember what I was gonna say. Oh, I can't remember. The only thing I caught in it was not great fruit. It was um, close door close. Cantaloupe, that was it. That was because I used cantaloupe as a bait. Can't forget the keys. And also, if you remember the video, I think it's titled 350 Startup Open Headers. I don't know why. It's something like that. That's this truck. And yes, I just off the trap. This truck has no trap in it. That's a good trap to put in it. Oh, right, if you don't know how to set these traps, here, I'm just going to show you how to set it while I'm here. Because, look, this is how you set it. You flip these things up. To be really good at it, you can do it without it, but flip them up and you just push this down. I know it's not great in focus. You just latch that around it. Kinda. There's a little. Right there. That little latch is what's holding it together. Yep, it's focused. And then you can't forget to put that over and that over. And we're just gonna do this this easy. It's not focusing, but it should be okay. See that gap next to the shifter? This track is gonna go right about. There. There's peanut butter on there. I normally use corn, chicken feed, scratch corn. Hopefully, I don't set it off. Let's see? Yeah, yeah, I did not set it off. So, yeah, I got the keys. I did not lock them in the building again. And yes, I have locked them in there. Camera's doing something weird. Fixed it. Got some more peanut butter and an empty water bottle. Let's see. Nope. I don't have anything else. I don't have any more to make. So. What I'm going to do is I'm going to. Go check the snake trap. And then. Probably pick this up in the morning. Maybe I'll show you. I'm going to do something with this. 
leftover peanut butter. Maria! Maria! Okay, if she's down here, well, I'm taking the snakes, right? She's getting some free peanut butter. Mostly because she tried to steal it earlier. And I was feeding it to her. I said, you can have a lick. And she stole all the peanut butter. And I see there's a little drop of water on the lens. That is a microscopic speck, but it looks so giant on there. Okay, yeah. Um, Maria! Come on, Maria! Let's go! Come on! I got some peanut butter. Come on, Maria! Let's go! I got some peanut butter. Maria, come on! Come on, Maria! <sighs> Trying to get her over here. Maria! Come on! Come on! Come on, Maria! Here she comes. Here, you want some peanut butter? Let me turn it over so you can, your tongue can lick it. Lick it. I don't know if this is going to be cool. Not, but. This is what I'm seeing. Okay, that's good. You ate enough of the peanut butter, Maria. You had a full teaspoon, I think. I don't know. I know it's, I'm pretty sure that's a teaspoon. I'm not specifically sure. Sit that there so she don't get choked on it. Now I'm going to go check the snake trap. I'm going to be down there. Right now. Okay. Just did the first jump. See, so look. There's the pigeons. Right there. That black one's Delta. She's the mom of the one on top, that one. Delta, her baby. Those two right there, that's their baby. I'm gonna show you where that snake was before I pull up the trap. And she tell you why I'm gonna try to catch him. Because there was a snake right there this morning. And I was standing about right here, walking by, making sure there wasn't nothing in there. There was one right there, and I was like, uh-oh, there's a snake right there. Giant snake, giant snake, and then it's no longer there. First night, it was right about there. Yeah, it was right there, with one in its mouth. And then the other one, the next day, was on the other side of that board, climbing up the fence. Right now, I'm just going to check. I'm going to zoom y'all in on that. I know we don't have nothing, but I'm still going to zoom y'all in. I know it's not great in focus, but that's that's what we're dealing with. A minor trap. Just a regular old minor trap. We've got two eggs in it. Two fresh eggs from the pigeon. I don't know if my camera just did that, but it just did something weird. But right there is the minor trap. It's got two eggs, three eggs in there. And I got a piece of paracord right here. 550 so. Unless that snake can break 550 inside a mirror trap tied to the pigeon because it ain't getting out. I'm going to tie a bear knot here, but that's it. Get you. And I'm going to pick this back up in the morning. I'm going to fix this knot right here because it just came loose from there. So let's go. Three. Okay, we're going time jump. It's going to be like a millisecond for you. It's going to be like hours for me. Yeah, it's going to be about, I don't know, it's going to be hours. So let's go. Three, two, one. Okay, it's the next day. So I got this trap set. And... It's empty. So, nothing. And we're going to go check the mice, check around the pigeons, make sure no snakes. And we're going to go check the mice traps that we set yesterday. Pigeons are on the ground, so you gotta be careful. See, look, there's one that's sued. That one's a smart one because it's raining right now. Okay, we're gonna go check the mice traps, right? 
Yeah, it, I edited the footage from the footage they just seen before this. See, look, I'm wearing a different shirt. So, I edited the footage of me wearing a different shirt yesterday, setting everything. So, it was already like 15 minutes long, so I'm probably just gonna cut it off. Check the mouse traps. Cut it off. Try to keep this pretty short. And then take this back either tomorrow or the next day. I don't know. Oh, we got one. We got one. Got one in the truck. Traps set it. Oh, traps turned off on the truck. Okay, maybe this video ain't going to be as bad as I thought. Oh, yeah, we got one. Oh, yeah. There's a little mouse. And we only have one trap, so that should be fine. Okay. So we got one mouse out of three, four traps. Okay, we're back. Checking that snake trap. I think we got one. We'll pull this up here. Check it. Nothing. My bait. My bait's missing. But we got nothing. My bait's missing. Click here to subscribe, click here to see the last video, and click here to see just a random video. So, I'm going to be setting this one back, so, same spot. Uh. Give this video a like if you want to see some more of it. Awesome happens.